Hi right, guys, it's Mr. Skipper again. And now I'm wearing these OnePlus Bullets Wireless Z Base Edition wireless earphones. And uh, I wanted to show you how they look. So when I'm wearing these, the edges of the earphones kind of stick outside your head. So you can't really lie down on your left or right side while wearing these. Um, so that is something you have to consider. There are a few uh, earphones where like, there's barely any earpiece hanging outside. So think about that, but it's not a, it's not a big deal. It feels very snug and fit. I don't feel any weight um, while wearing these. And yeah, it's a, it's a nice tight fit. I don't feel like it's going to fall out anytime soon. Another thing to note is it's it's nicely snug um, in my ears and it feels like it's a nice fit but it doesn't feel like uh, there's some kind of vacuum or suction being created inside my um, inside my ear canal. Many earphones including uh, especially the lower quality ones like Xiaomi's basic earphones uh, they cost around 300 right? So those kinds of earphones they create this annoying suction kind of feeling inside your ears and it feels like uh, and as time goes by it gets more and more irritating and also it, i think that's something called passive noise cancellation i'm not really sure how that works but it, apparently it's like it creates um a kind of vacuum inside your ear and thanks to that vacuum it um sound from the outside is unable to propagate into your ear canal it works but it's not that comfy these, on the other hand, they have active noise cancellation. And uh, so they're very comfortable to wear, don't have any issues there, and they don't feel that heavy at all. Uh, that's the advantage of wearing a neckband. When you buy uh, truly wireless earphones, everything, the microphones, the drivers, the batteries, everything is in this little earpiece. So if you want to try to compress all of that stuff into that little earpiece, it's either going to increase the weight or the quality is going to be lower. Here, I don't have that problem. Now, moving on, um, let me let me show you something. So, this is something that I was worried about. Like, what if you're exercising and what if the earphones fall out? Let me see. So, I'm running right now. And the earphones barely feel like they're going to fall out. Maybe I should try something like burpees. <laughs> So let's see. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's. Okay, I'm gonna try some burpees. <laughs> okay. So as you can see, one of them fell out. But I don't, I still don't think it's a game changer. You see, a neck band, when you're wearing it and when an earphone falls out, it's not like it's gonna fall on the ground and get stepped on, or it's not like it's gonna fall down and get scratched or break. It's just gonna fall out and land on, or land right in front of your chest. But if you buy a truly wireless, um, truly wireless earphones, you're gonna have a problem. Let's just say, you're trying to get aboard a bus uh, and you're trying to run and you try to catch it and in the process of doing so god forbid let's say one of them falls out what happens a truly wireless earphone or earbud rather falls on the ground someone could step on it a vehicle could roll over it it's a big problem you see but these if they fall out they just land in front of your chest nothing to worry about so if you're going for Bluetooth, wireless earphones, definitely go for a neckband or the big headphones. Do not go for truly wireless. I know it's the trend, but it's not practical. Just think about it. And another thing is if I want to listen to somebody speaking, I just have to unplug this and let it hang in front of my body. I don't have to take it out and put it in a case or in my pocket, right? This is a lot more convenient. I just take it out and let it hang here. When I'm done talking, I just plug it back in. It's a lot more convenient. I don't have to hold anything. So 
That's why I think this is a lot more convenient, a lot more practical. I bought this only because of the practicality. And if it wasn't so practical, I probably would have gone for the Sennheiser 275S earphones because those are fantastic earphones. And they've got a freaking two-year warranty. So, yeah, those are actually worth getting. So, yeah, as you can see, the wires, the, the neckband itself doesn't move much as I run or exercise. But it's the earphones that are liable to fall out. I know I'm wearing a mask. That could be a reason why one of them fell out. And also another reason is I might need to change the rubber tips to a smaller size because I have small ears. <laughs> so, yeah, maybe that might change something. But I guess that's all you need to know for now. Uh, I'd say these are fantastic earphones, very comfortable. People say that Bluetooth earphones tend to have poorer quality in terms of uh, the um, sound quality and stuff and the clarity. They say the Bluetooth isn't that great, but to be honest, I was impressed, very impressed. And in my honest opinion, anything under 800 rupees, or maybe rather anything under 700 rupees, uh, with wires can't compete with this. I'd say the only thing that can compete with this under 1,000 rupees would be the Sennheiser earphones, those uh, CX-180 earphones. Except for Sennheiser CX-180, I don't think any other earphones under 1,000 can compete with these. And if you're spending above 1,000, why not get these, right? I got these for 2,000. I know that's a lot, but think about this. It's practical and it's worth it. And also, it's less it's less liable for damage. If I had wired earphones, they could snag on stuff, and the wires get weak over time, especially near the jack. So this is very convenient, don't you think? Nothing to plug in. Only thing you have to worry about is charging it. And and when you're charging it, it's not like something that you uh, you do recklessly. When you charge it, it's like a slow thing. It's it, there's no urgency there, so it's easy to plug in the charger and take out the charger and I think it's a lot more convenient. So overall, this is my review of these uh, earphones. I listen to music from all, a lot of different genres. I'm a guitarist, so I like listening to guitar music. I love rock. I love metal. I also love alternative rock, but besides these, I love other genres too. I love instrumentals, uh, like covers, instrumental covers, piano, uh, the cello, and other d different instruments. And uh, yeah, all of those sounded very clear on these, surprisingly, because they said that it was the bass edition. I thought it would be like one of those earphones, which is like overpowered bass and everything else is not that great or it's mediocre. But no, these weren't mediocre. These actually were fantastic. And when you consider that you're nowadays getting such good quality Bluetooth earphones at just 2,000 rupees, I think it's worth it. 